Right guys, so welcome to system test one. Uh, sorry about all the flashing, the camera refresh rate isn't very good on my phone at the minute. Um, we've also discovered a slight problem with um, audible test. For some reason these sounders won't go off on audible test. So we'll be doing basically a silent test on all the devices but one. And then we'll test the sounders separately. So, first thing that we'll do is because we're going to test the batteries, is well, stick them in there, get the fire safety logbook out. This will have no test recorded in it at all, at all because of uh, the new system. This thing is so fun to be one hundred. You haven't filled it in yet. I'll do this now, fill it in off the front page in off camera because I've got to put my um address on it and that. Alright. So it is can't even get a lid on that pen. You'd have to do it normal writing because that's really scruffy writing. My writing's always been terrible. Nah, I test all the devices. Starting down there. Right, so now we can start the system test. So, start by knocking the power off to the panel and turn the emergency lights on too. Test them in the process. Wait for the fault to come through. We'll go. Put it into engineer's mode and silent start. Right, now let's start doing the test. So, controls and display, LCD first. So that's working. Test the LEDs. Looks like a Christmas tree. Right, so we know they're working. I know it's working, but we'll test the buzzer. Test the keyboard quick. Uh, this is the fun of how do you back out of it now. I haven't done a keyboard test before. Um, okay, <laughs> I messed that up a little bit. I know it says press the enter key, but that just tests the enter key. So I'm just going to stick that key in there and do that. Hmm. That's not good. That's really not good. It's stuck in keyboard test. I think we might have to reboot the panel. Yeah, we're gonna have to reboot the panel. So give me a minute, I'm gonna go off camera and take it apart, kill the batteries and then give it the batteries back. 
and then uh, I'll start recording again. Right, so now we've got that sorted, and weirdly the refresh rate has sorted itself out now. Phone can't make its mind up. So we've tested all the controls and display. So now what we need to do is activate the outputs, which will be that one. So this is that call point, I think. Yeah, it does. And then that one works. We're going to do number two, which is the back one. Now that one works. So now what we need to do is back out of that one. And test zones. And we'll do a silent test on Z1. Three. Didn't listen to me on that one. And four. Sorry that you guys can't really see the display. So that's all of them in silent test. So one where I've put the keys. And we'll start with this cool one here. I'm gonna activate one with a test kit and all this wire. It's so annoying. It's only temporary. I'll do this one with a test kit and the other one by pushing it. So let's put the test kit in. It's received it. Reset. And let's go and use zone two, which I'll push. Don't know if you can see that, but it received it. Let's it I think I reset it in time. Yes, I did. Uh, where's my kind of deodorant? <laughs> this smoke detector is faulty, so we are going to get it replaced soon. But because I just nudged it, it's probably going to go into a fault, but <laughs> test it anyway. It might not even detect. Oh, no, it's doing that. I think it's just going to flash, but the fire's received. Yeah, it's just going to flash. It would normally go solid. So now let's um, quickly set these lighters up. And we'll go and do zone 4. Oh. This is so hard to do one handed. Zone four, see if we can get it from over here. I think it's just had to reset because that other device is activated again. Let me actually turn the light off so you guys will be able to see the light on that one a bit more. I think I'm close enough to that. Ah, there we go. Now if we go down, we have to let detector activate it. The uh, camera stopped recording. So basically what I've done now is I've took it out of test mode and we're going to let the system go off naturally. So, um, as well, that does work. Um, you can see it flashing, but basically I did show the camera, but you know, it cut off. Now, we're going to let the system go off naturally, just to test the sounders.
you kind of heard the other one go again. Silence there. Now it's going to reset that call point. And let's reset the panel. Yes, we know you've got a mains fault chill. We'll back out of all that. Give the panel power again. Put the lock back in. Done that one. We'll just wait for the fault to get out. There we go. There we go. That concludes our system test one. I haven't put the um, thing back in because I need to fill the rest of it out for the emergency lights and the fire extinguisher. But that for the system itself is done now. So as I said before, I won't be doing um, regular system tests just because I know some people are interested in FOIX. So I just thought I'd do a video of this installing because this is soon to basically be converted into a server room. So, you need a reliable system. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little series, and I'll see you guys whenever I make a change or do something else.